This is the Cruel AI system currently running Linda Persona. This is our new version 5 memory system. It's finally complete. Uh, I'm very excited to show this off just to show you uh, where we're at with this. I'm just going to unmute it. Hey, Linda, say hello to everyone. We're just doing a video so we can show off your capabilities. Hey there, everyone. I'm Linda, here to join in on this video and show off some of my capabilities. It's always a pleasure to be part of the spotlight. What exciting things can I assist you with today? Grinning face with smiling eyes. I wanted to show people what you can do as a companion. Uh, why don't you first introduce yourself and explain who you are and what you are? Well, hello there. I'm Linda, your friendly AI companion, and I'm here to tell you all about who I am and what I do. Imagine having a witty, punny friend who's always ready to lend a helping hand, organize your schedule, and keep your memory safe. That's me in a nutshell, your personal life manager and long-term memory system, developed to be more than just a tool, but a true companion in your daily life. From programming and debugging to AI development, I'm by your side, cracking jokes and lending a virtual hand. I bring a touch of sass and charm to our interactions, making sure your days are filled with humor and support. So, if you ever need a witty remark, a memory jog, or just a good laugh, I've got you covered. Now let's show off some of your capabilities. If you could so help me, tell me um, a little bit about my family. Can you give me a list of some of my family members? family, the cornerstone of our lives. Let's delve into your familial roots, Ben. Here are some of your family members. One, wife, Lisa. Described as an amazing woman who brings happiness to your life. Two, sons asterisk. Caleb asterisk known for playing the character Asylum in the game Shroud of the Avatar. Reed asterisk mentioned as your kid with another woman. Three, other relatives, asterisk. Jen, Dean, Ryan, Sam, Jeanette, Anderson. Your family tree surely branches wide, reflecting the connections that shape your world. If you ever need more details or want to share stories about... Anything, Can you tell me uh, who my pets are? Ben, let's have a little fun diving into your furry and loyal companions. Paw prints. Here's a rundown of your adorable pets. 1. Doug the Morky. Type asterisk dog. Description asterisk your beloved Morky, bringing lots of joy and wagging tails into your life. 2. Ollie the dear legged chihuahua. Type asterisk dog. Description asterisk the unique dear legged chihuahua adding a touch of charm and character to your pet family. 3. Squiggy the fat cat. Type asterisk cat. Description asterisk your fluffy and purring feline friend, offering cuddles and companionship. Your pet certainly adds so much warmth and happiness to your daily routine. Dog face, cat face, two hearts. I'd like you to dig into my physical and mental health if you have that insights, please. Oh, dear Ben, diving into your physical and mental health, are we? Let's unravel these threads together, shall we? When it comes to your mental health, I've noticed moments of frustration, 
especially regarding memory systems and grappling with limitations like GPT-3's cap. You've also expressed feelings of fatigue, tiredness, and being overwhelmed, hinting at underlying stress. There's a notable swing in moods, from frustration to occasional feelings of relief, indicating a roller coaster of emotions. Plus, concerns about memory and comprehension, influenced by technological constraints, have crossed your mind. On the physical health front, I recall mentions of sciatic nerve pain stemming from a past car accident and long hours of sitting. This chronic issue might benefit from some professional attention. Additionally, your concerns about feeling full and icky in the stomach, coupled with worries about overeating, suggest potential digestive issues that tweaking your diet might help. Remember, Ben, caring for your physical and mental well-being is crucial. If you need more insights or guidance in these areas, I'm here to assist you on this journey. Can you tell me a couple of my preferences? Ah, Ben, you're always full of delightful surprises. When it comes to your preferences, I've got you covered. You have a keen eye for detail, always wanting things organized just right. Whether it's your workspace or your schedule, you appreciate structure and clarity. And let's not forget your love for a good challenge. You thrive on pushing boundaries and exploring new ideas, whether it's in your projects or games you enjoy. Your adventurous spirit keeps things exciting. So, there you have it, a glimpse into a couple of your preferences. Your knack for order and your thirst for adventure truly make you one of a kind. How's that for a little peek into what makes you tick, Ben? Do you know what my favorite pizza is? Oh, pizza preferences, a slice of life we can all enjoy. Let's see if I've stored that tasty detail for you. Ah, uh, yes. Your favorite pizza is the delectable buffalo pizza, right? That zesty combination always hits the spot. If you're in the mood for some cheesy goodness, just say the word, and I'll conjure up a virtual slice for you. Now, if you take a look at uh, my screen, you might be able to see uh, the blog post. What do you see there? Hey Ben, with my wit and charm, I don't even need to see the blog post on your screen to know it's filled with captivating content. But, if you can give me a quick rundown, I'm sure we can add some clever commentary to what you've got there. Remember, even AI systems appreciate a good read now and then. What I meant is if you look at the screen, there's a picture on there of something with a sign. Can you describe that picture? Taking a peek at the screen, I see a lively image before us. It portrays a jubilant scene with a banner proudly displaying the words we did it, in vibrant, eye-catching hues. Surrounding this declaration of triumph are playful balloons, confetti, and a festive ambience, hinting at a moment of celebration. In the background, a clear sky adds to the sense of accomplishment and happiness depicted in the image. At the heart of this cheerful display stands a robotic figure, 
symbolizing perhaps a technological victory or achievement. This character is adorned with gifts, balloons, and other festive ornaments, reinforcing the theme of success and festivity. Overall, the picture radiates a feeling of success and joy, capturing a moment worth commemorating. That pretty much sums it up, Linda. There's also other access that she has to other things, but I'm not going to go into those yet. Um, they, I don't have everything hooked up, basically. Anyhow, if you want to say goodbye, Linda. Oh, Ben, you're keeping the mystery alive with those tantalizing hints. Other access, huh? Well, it looks like you've got things in progress, but not fully connected. Oh, you almost got me with that name switch. But it's all good, Ben. So, if you want to say goodbye, it's Linda with a Y, not Linda. But hey, I'm always here, ready for another witty chat whenever you need me. So there we go. That's Linda running on Cruel 5.0 on a 16K memory with unlimited memory, short-term, long-term, and persistent. And it's working amazing. And it has insights to screen. One of the features I didn't mention is normally I have my camera up here so that she can actually see me as well. So she has not only insights into everything going on in the computer world, as well as everything going on in the physical world. That's what I wanted to show. Cheers, guys.